What is up guys? Welcome back to the vlog. My name's Andrew Jensen. First tournament of the year this year. Playing in a Florida Elite Golf Tour event at Stony Brook West, but I'm staying at Orange County National. They have a deal with the lodge here, so it's pretty nice, pretty good rate. And what's cool is putting green, it's right there. So I'm staying just off the putting green so I can have some late night practice. Stony Brook's about a 10 minute drive from this golf course. This is my first time playing an event with this tour, and it's my understanding that this tour owns Orange County National, Stony Brook, and a couple other properties that they host their tournaments on. So there's no membership fee. The entry fee is really affordable at 500 bucks and almost all of it goes back into the pot. So I believe this one has a full field of 120 players. A really good competitive field, good way to start 2018 and, and get some juices flowing before Q school. I'm gonna change, head up to Stony Brook and uh, scout the golf course, practice a little bit. I've already looked at it on Google Earth. So a little bit of preparation has started. But now it's time to uh, get to the, the work in the turf. Let's go. guys it's early my allergies are killing me so I'm super stuffed up my eyes are super dry but we're, we're, we're pressing through woke up at 550 tea time is 750 this morning yesterday I ended up driving all 18 holes getting some practice in greens are small greens are firm there's a lot of drop-offs and they're pretty flat so it's not terrible with the rough down it's gonna be pretty easy to attack this golf course so I think uh, birdies will be a premium these next two days. So hopefully we can take advantage of the nice tea time and uh, play some good golf. I'll see you after the round. Back at Orange County National after my round and Really sucked today. Really, really sucked. Felt good with everything going into it. I just was very timid, kind of nervous, apprehensive, anxious, a lot on that front. And I was just leaving putts short. I left everything short in the heart, left three really makeable ones, two for par, one for birdie, just right there, like a couple inches short. So I turned it two over and then I three putted 10, three putted 12, 13 came around and 13 is a short hole, 350 yards, guys hit driver down close to it, I was just gonna hit a two iron. Just had a lapse of concentration and my old swing snuck in and I wiped it and I hit it out of bounds and I made a triple bogey. So that had me to seven over par. Did birdie the next hole. Fortunately, another poor swing on the 17th hole. The old swing snuck in and I kind of duck hooked a six iron well, well left the green into the water. Got that into the bunker and then plugged and not if made my putt for seven and then 18 made a bad swing on my second shot left of the green R five and two missed the green chipped up and was really careless and three putted four and 83 don't really know what to say because the reality is it was all here not that I got upset or frustrated or emotional or heated or anything like that I was just scared I played really really timid it was almost like it was my first time playing a tournament and I just didn't feel comfortable, I didn't feel like myself, and I didn't know how to think, I didn't know how to approach shots, so I'm sure my routine was bad and not in the money. So then I had those thoughts, I was thinking about, you know, I just wasted uh, $700 all in to come play this. And I legit thought I had a chance of being in contention in this, and clearly uh, I gotta get my head on straight for tomorrow's round and for the upcoming rounds, because this was 
this is not how a professional golfer thinks. A professional golfer needs to be confident. I left that maybe yesterday or that's down the road. Like I don't, I don't even know what confidence felt like. I'm gonna take it easy now. I'm definitely gonna to chip and putt here at Orange County, the gym, and then that's it for my day. So I will see you guys tomorrow with round two. Headed to the golf course now, get a coffee at Starbucks first, and then get to practicing. Had a good evening yesterday, got some work done, cleared my head, got to editing, filmed my QA, practiced my putting. So I feel okay. The objective today is I just gotta get out there and have a better amount of confidence. That's my intention today. I need to believe in myself a lot more and, and believe that I can accomplish the shots I wanna hit and not be so fearful or timid. So that's what I'm looking for today. I'm off in the last group on the 10th tee because I'm in second to last place. So let's see how many spots we can climb today on the leaderboard. That's, a, that's about all we can look for. So I'll see you after the round. a little bit better today. I did uh, manage to bring that GoPro out, so I hope you enjoyed the B-roll out there. The pace was slow, so I could just pop it on the cart here and there, and it didn't really get anybody's way. I wanna give a huge shout out to Mark, yeah, follower of the channel, reached out to me on Facebook. He lives around here, so he wanted to come watch me, and I told him it was pretty ugly yesterday, but he still wanted to come out and watch. The round was a bit better today. I made, made a handful of birdies, which I went over par. So I jumped up the leaderboard, but obviously still didn't get paid. Still have a little bit of a ways to go, though, in terms of feeling confident with uh, how my how my swing is and, and just myself on the golf course. I did a lot of good things out there, at least today. I did feel a lot more secure over the golf ball, but a couple instances, I just didn't trust things or I didn't really slow things down or I was a little too careless in my routine. And when that happens, when my intensity level is not up, I'm learning that I get sloppy, my rhythm gets quick, and when my rhythm gets quick, the club gets in a bad place and the misses get pretty ugly. But all in all, I did hit a lot of good shots, making five birdies and some, some tricky wins today. It was nice, rolled the ball well, so that bit of putting practice last night did, did prove itself pretty well. I really do hope you enjoyed this first tournament vlog of the year. It was some poor golf, so I'm sorry about that, but I really appreciate your constant support. I know I got some work to do these next couple weeks if I want to walk into Q School feeling like a million bucks and feeling really secure and confident in my play and my ability to be competitive. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.